Hey everybody, the Bonga is back. Welcome to part 3 of Let's Play Akuji the Heartless, brought to you by GameAnyone.com. Alright, there's still one more level in this vestibule that we gotta go through, and that's Kallus. So, let's take care of that while we can. I did go back to Kokitas to get some of the uh, voodoo dolls that I missed by continuously jumping while on the slope. And I noticed one thing. Those voodoo dolls, they do not regenerate when you re-enter a level. I guess it keeps it so that you're not farming for like max health by the time you're within the first stage. So we made it to Kallus, the Sanctum of Hate. Vastu must be destroyed before his many protectors. Use your reflection to guide you through peril. Oh, so I guess there's going to be mirrors involved? hope it's not going to be a confusing it stage. It disgusts me the ease by which I collect the spirits of my ancestors. Had I known the afterlife was a stagnant pool of festering memories, I would have done more to protect my flesh and life. And it drives me harder to save Keisho from it. Yeah, like maybe have a different brother? Hell blast. Okay. Let's see what we gotta deal with here. Looks like there's falling chunks of guts. So I might have to watch out for that. Doesn't look like it hurts you or anything. I knew what those levers do, because you were able to flick them back. Okay, apparently those masks you can destroy. Or at least hit them to get spells. I wonder if there's more like that on this side, too. Is that a ladder? No, that's a cage. Hold on, can I, um... Can I go hit those? I suppose I can hit that one. But I'd rather save my spells. There, we can just get more. I still have no idea what that switch did. Maybe it did something with those blocks. As soon as I stepped on the pentagram, that guy shows up. Or at least he died rather quickly. Which is good for me. I think I gotta climb up here. It's a bat! Come here! You need to die! Maybe I gotta jump on that chandelier to reach him. Because he ain't coming this way. Oh, he nipped me right in the leg! But it's nice to know it didn't cancel my jump. That's hilarious. Yeah, that bat was made out of bones, alright. This is a rather creepy looking level. You know what it reminds me of? Well, I missed everything. It reminds me of Shadow Man for the Nintendo 64. I mean, it was also for PlayStation and apparently for PC. But when I let's played it on my channel, like, many years ago, it was for the N64. And it was a really fun game. There wasn't enough let's plays of it. Maybe there's not many let's plays of this one as well. But then again, it's, not my, it's my fault for not looking to see how many there are. Maybe there are quite a few, but there aren't as many, I would imagine. Hey, Zombro, you need to die. Getting a fair amount of voodoo dolls just from these masks. I'm guessing that stuff will hurt me if I land on it. What does this do? Oh, creates another one of those, uh... Block panels. Apparently those iron coffins over there give you uh, power-ups as well. Another thing I have to look for. I think 
there's some over here. One of these days, they're gonna... It's gonna be a trap, and I'm gonna be releasing another zombie. Damn it. God, these guys are annoying. What's my hint? Hold crouch button and use directional buttons to swing a Kuji while on monkey bars. Press jump while swinging to propel a Kuji forwards or backwards. That could come in handy. That could come in handy, like, as soon as here. Let me get that spell first. Let me try to get that ancestor. Okay, the swinging does require a little bit of practice to get done right. Like, for instance, like, you're trying to swing forward, but you're not getting a lot of momentum. That's better. Ooh, and I can jump on these, too. Let's see if I can get a good shot at that bat. Oh, he went back into it. What an idiot. I like when my enemies lack basic intelligence. Okay, there's a checkpoint over here, and I'm seeing a lot of acid. Of spinning traps, too. Can't just destroy them. So you have to be very careful. Hmm, what's that in there? No, that was just a skull. Never mind. Would not be in my best interest to, uh, try to jump into that. Yep, those platforms sink as soon as you land on them. Good thing I didn't stay on them. Hmm. What's this? Seems to be a hidden ledge. Hey, another ancestor. God, these faces look so... Menacing. It's like they're chewing on a lemon. Ah, God. That's a pain in the ass, id. Okay, these actually move. Hi. God, only takes like one rolling kick to get these guys. It just totally dismembers them. That's so cool. Don't know how those guys didn't stand a chance. These, uh, liches are total pushovers. Can I destroy that face? No. Okay. Whoa! Okay, you almost gave me a bit of a jump scare. Bad, you're a wimp too. Hmm, here's a new spell. Doom blast. Wait, I probably already have that, do I? I'm thinking Doom Blast is just really good. Because you only get like so few of them per skull. I'll try to hold on to them as long as I can. Oh, those are kinda like the Mega Man platforms. As soon as you stand on one, another appears. Well, I mean, they don't function the exact same way, but that's how they function in this area. Hmm. Okay, I see what I gotta do. That's how the mirrors work. Hey! There we go. 
surprised that chandelier doesn't give out on my, under my own weight. But we got the lar, so I think we have to head back. There we go. Now, nice of him to just, like, s stay perfectly still. It's like, oh, he's putting that down. I better just leave him be. Checkpoint. Okay, how does this work? Hmm. Okay, it's just going clockwise. Oh, no, I want to go that way. Okay, looks like I can get some more magic if I go over here. Almost didn't make it. And I see an ancestor. But, how do I reach it? Hold on, what's this? that opened the cell. And that's our third ancestor, right away. Doesn't do anything about that cell, though. Okay, I think I have to go this way to get the lar first. And then I gotta go the other way to put it on. Nope, those cells are meaningless. Man, imagine if this was like Doom. As soon as you get one of those Lars, you get ambushed. I mean, Doom was like that a lot. You just pick up like one key item, and then BAM, a lot of monsters disappear. I've had Doom requested to me a lot, but I mean, shooters are not exactly my forte. Oh, gotta be fast for this one. Fast-ish. I almost got a hundred of these voodoo dolls. I mean, the good thing about going back to levels again and again is that at least the enemies return, so you can use that as an opportunity to get more lives. Hmm. Okay, I guess I gotta wait. As they end up dropping down where the electro platform is. And what if I don't land on it? I could possibly die. Can't take that risk. Hey, come here, Mr. Bat. Even though you don't have any skin, I still hate you under virtue of you being a bat, all right? That's just how it goes in my world. Do I need to go this way? Feels like it's kind of like in a weird junction. Well, I missed the kick, but that's okay. Got to go in here. Let's go. Ah, it's another mirror. Hang on. Oh, okay. There's an ancestor over here, too. I wonder what's on the way down. to find out. Maybe I have to go down at some point, but I don't know. Okay, this is a little tricky. And I missed. Uh, I think I can get back up pretty easily. Did you just kick me right in the gut? appreciate that at all. 
But we have all the ancestors. All we need to do is just finish the stage. And this, my friend, is why I keep it to one stage per video. Because even though the second episode was pretty short, what if the next one ends up being pretty long? All because I decided to do two things in one video. That's better. I like how the music gets more upbeat when you're fighting. <laughs> Definitely gives off a lot of Ocarina of Time feels. When the music starts to ramp up as soon as you get in the fight. I think I'll take that. Altars over here. I think I gotta go this way. There's a switch. Uh, let me just fix that back up. I think this is a bit of a puzzle. about this for a moment. What if I do this? I think I'm looking at this in proportion to where I started. Okay, that did something. Oh, oh, almost didn't make it. What the hell are you floating on? Hit the bridge again. And then we'll just get on the bridge again and flip that switch. Like so. Yeah, because now we can get across. did it. I think that's the last of the stage. Yep, they, oh, oh god, they disappear after a while. Oh no. Get out. Oh good, there's a la there's a ladder! Climb the ladder! Climb the ladder of success, and by success I mean not dying. Okay, that, that's brutal. Oh god, as soon as you like... Oh god, I don't have any... Sh I don't have a shield spell. The thing that would have helped me here... Like, as soon as you grab a ledge, you're pretty much screwed. So you gotta make sure you land right on the middle of the platform. Oh god, I was going back! Take a nice bit of damage from the acid, too. Okay, let's try this again, and hopefully I do it right. Oh, thank God there's a heart over here. God, that could have killed me. all this. Oh, hi! Okay, if I just gotta fight these guys, it's no big deal. Hi. Where are you? Oh god, it shoots at you! Where's your range? Not very far. Yeah. 
Maybe I just shoot at it from here, it should be safe. There we go. So if I get too close, <laughs> it's gonna be trouble. Nothing else of value. We'll just leave. Okay, we managed to make a lot of progress. Okay, that's not a percentage, but rather how many uh, ancestors I got. Gotcha. Yes, you served me well, Akuchi. You have collected enough souls. I opened the door to Mahdi's lair. Defeat him, and you may enter the second vestibule of hell. Okay, you know what? I think we have a little bit of time to take on the boss. So we made it to Mahdi. Prepare to meet the Guardian of the First Vestibule. Shoot floating Taurus points. What's a Taurus? It's not that bull Pokemon, is it? The price I must it? pay for the sins of my family is high. I have been reduced from a prince to an indentured assassin. I seek to ensure the survival of my beloved Keisho. And to obtain it, I will kill and kill again. Okay, it must be these things. Ah, uh, nice of you to shoot that for me. Hell blast. Okay, so he's almost like a dinosaur. Okay, when he starts shooting, I need to keep moving. Or jump, if it comes to that. Soul Seeker. Oh, I almost fell off. Okay, he sometimes attacks you when he gets over there. Not going too well so far. Hopefully I don't run out of the, this stuff. Yeah, he can hit you pretty hard immediately. Just get one kick on him and run. Leave me alone! Okay, when he's running away, he's he's not gonna cross very bad yet. Okay, when you run out of magic, there's always more that appears, so that's very helpful. He's almost dead. Yeah, he's down. Not a hard boss, but he can be I a pain. Have defeated the Mahdi, oh great Baron. Please accept this sacrifice as a token of my goodwill. Look, I, I killed a thing for your love. Acknowledge me. All right, second warden needs 19 souls, or ancestors, rather. So we need to get at least seven within the second vestibule to move on. Gotcha. I've now opened the second vestibule for you to purge. Survive the arena of death and you will reach the spirit gate that will return you here from Oinos. Uh, okay. So I guess the second vestibule is just over this way. 
over here is Oinos. That's where we gotta go. There's also Discord, which is... Which took over the realm of Skype. <laughs> Stygia. And... What does that one say? Hutama. Oh, so there's like four levels in here. Okay, that's interesting. At least this vestibule looks a little bit nicer. More lit. Um, I'm gonna stop here, and in the next episode, we'll take on Oinos. See ya, everybody.